Season 2, Episode 2, Part 1. All right, so we need to find the definite integral. Um, we know it's definite because it's got these boundaries on it. We're integrating over a certain range. So let's do this. Look, don't, we, we want the actual power there. We don't want it on the bottom of a fraction. That just confuses things. So the first thing I'm going to do is make that into a power on the top of a fraction. It means it's going to be a negative power dot dx. Now we can integrate it, we can apply our standard rules. So we're going to get increase the power by 1, be careful with negatives. Increasing by 1 means it's now going to be negative 1. Divide by the new power. It's a bit weird. Let's clean that up a bit. So 2 divided by negative 1 is just negative 2. Oh, actually, even better. Negative 2 and x to the negative 1 means just an x on the bottom, x to the power of 1. Right, now we can substitute in our values. We substitute in 3 and take away what we get with 2. So it's going to be negative 2 on 3, take away negative 2 on 2. So that's negative 2 thirds plus 1. 2 on 2 is just 1, double negative, plus 1. That should give me 1 third. Now, ideally, you can, uh, you can check that on a graphics calculator or whatnot. Works nicely here. 